Uh, windows are very similar to doors. Uh, double clicking the window tool. Um, you'll notice by the way both doors and windows don't have layers. So um, doors and windows are always associated with the parent wall that they are put into. So you delete the wall and the windows that are, or doors that are in that wall also get deleted. Uh, and you can't have a window or a door independent of a wall. Okay, so you, you need to put them in. When they go in, they just like I showed you before with skylights, they automatically cut a hole in the wall and then place the window or the door in there. Um, so windows, uh, oh, and by the way, don't go looking for doors in the window tool and vice versa for looking for windows in the door tool. You won't find them. Separate tools, uh, you, they link you into Archicad's library uh, and you can only see windows in the window tool. Um, so here in the library, there's a folder for windows and uh, you can go through and have a look at uh, all the windows available for you. Um, let's go to a sliding a sliding window and it's brought it up. Um, you'll notice just like doors there's uh, all the sizes of the windows are there and I suppose if you want to uh, be accurate you could go and look up um, catalog window catalog set the sizes set all the characteristics and then save them as favorites so that you can always come back and use them again you don't have to go through all all these uh, setting up the setting up process but just like doors there's uh, a number of different settings and you can go through and choose the uh, types of things that you want uh, in general uh, just like doors as well you can uh, there's a section on sizes and a section on pens and materials and uh, you need to go through and set them up um, they're not always the default settings that you get when you first load ArchiCAD up may not be exactly what you want so you just need to go through and set some of these things up um, the materials you want it so if it's timber window or an aluminium window those sorts of things uh, and the pen weights that you want sometimes the pens are set to very thick pens and you need to fix them up um, Look, I'm not going to go through each one of these aspects. Um, what I will do, and I'll, I'll leave some of these up to you, what I will do is um, uh, just show you how to place a window in. Just like a door, you can place a window from the side or from the center. So, uh, for example, if I wanted to place a window over here, I'm placing it from the center. I click the outside edge and the window will go in. Um, whether you the eyeball is on the outside or the inside does affect the window. Um, so on this side, uh, in this case, the window has been put in. Uh, the eyeball represents the side of the frame that the window goes in. Uh, and in 3D, uh, the side, the uh, you can see the window has been oops, the window has been placed in a wall. Um, a timber window, clear finished timber window, uh, cut a hole in the wall automatically and the sill height has been set from the parameters. You can also by the way uh, place windows and doors uh, in the 3D window so I can uh, automatically place a door in there. Um, um, I can automatically place windows in walls as well. Okay. Um, once they're in, by the way, you can also uh, move them around and uh, drag them backwards and forwards to place them in the correct, correct places. Uh, but a number of things you, you really need to, to change. The width of the frame, uh, the detail that you want, those sorts of things. All of those are controlled through the dialog boxes and you can uh, you, you should spend a bit of time getting familiar with all of those um, having a look at what they do and having a look at both remember that there's 
uh, two buttons associated with each one of these settings. So you need to have a look at those. Um, I would experiment, try and uh, set up some windows, maybe look up some in a catalog and try and make them exactly the same um, and have a look at some of the other windows around. There's some um, special windows, shop fronts, basic windows, bay windows, um, and there's lots of uh, variations of each one.